Yeah. So I picked five, obviously because it's Top Five Wednesday. <laughs> a memoir. Who's this by? Michelle Domini Dominguez Green. Domin Dominguez. It's Spanish. <laughs> Jay and I'm here with another Top 5 Wednesday. It was created by Ginger Reeves Laney, so I will leave her link down below and you can go check her out. Also, I'll leave the Goodreads group down below so you can look for the topics and whatnot. This week's topic is to pick the five worst love interests, male or female. So without further ado, let us get started! My first love interest that I did not like is from Cold Kiss by Amy Garvey. This book follows Ren and her boyfriend, Danny. Only Danny is dead. I mean, like, it's the whole premise of the book, but your boyfriend's dead. And therefore, he can't be a good love interest because he's dead. He's a zombie, my friend. Move on. Move on, girl. The whole premise of this book is that Ren has to keep Danny hidden from people because he's dead, but he's still alive. And then this boy named Gabriel moves to her town and she starts liking him. And it's just this big love triangle. But this guy who's alive, so I mean, pick the guy who's alive and your dead boyfriend. I mean, is it... I would pick the alive one, but that's just me, common sense. I don't know. The next love interest that I didn't like is from Memoirs of a Teenage Amnesiac by Gabrielle Zevin. I still love saying her name like that. It follows Naomi, who falls down the stairs and gets amnesia. I didn't like either of the love interests in this book. One was Ace, who was her boyfriend before she got amnesia, and he was just a complete jerk, and then the other love interest is a boy named James, and he was also just a complete jerk, and I just didn't like them. I was rooting for Will. That's all I'm gonna say. Will and Naomi forever. I found James and Ace to be extremely annoying. They were just so full of themselves that it, it just drove me crazy. The next love interest I didn't like was from The Vacationers by Emma Strobe. I read this like in 2014. It was the first book I went off of Goodreads, so it holds a special place in my heart. It follows the Post family and they're a little bit dysfunctional. Daughter Sylvia meets this boy named Joan and he seems like the perfect lover. You think he's gonna be amazing and then he's not. And I didn't like him. He's a jerk and a bad man. You have to read the book, but he made me angry. I did not like him one bit. The next love interest I hated was from Keep Sweet by Michelle Dominiguez Green. I'm probably saying that author's name wrong. It follows Elva Jane, and she is in the Amish community, and she kisses this boy who she's known for a while, she's been crushing on him, and it's found out by her leaders or whatever, and she gets forced into this marriage with a 50-year-old not so nice guy who beats her and things like that. And so, I mean, like, beating your wife is not very nice, so I didn't like him at all because don't beat your wives or your husbands. Don't beat anybody. Be nice to each other, please. So I don't remember his name, though. That's how insignificant he is. The next love interest I really did not like is from The Perfect Mother by Nina Darton. This follows a mother named Jennifer who gets this call in the middle of the night from her daughter Emma who's studying abroad in Spain, and it turns out that she is now the leading suspect of this murder of a boy. The love interest for Emma is this boy named Rodrigo, and he's a drug dealer. So, I mean, drugs are bad, and therefore, he's not a good love interest, because why are you dating a drug dealer, girl? You can do better. You're supposed to be smart, even though you're a suspect in a murder, so you're not that smart. Drugs are bad, Emma. Drugs are bad. Alright, guys, so that was my Top 5 Wednesday for this week. I will see you in my next video. Goodbye! Italy? No. Island of Meloroca. 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 Whatever, they're on an island. The perfect mother. Who is this by? I don't know, I didn't check. Rodrigo. Rodrigo. Something like that. Rodrigo. Rodrigo. Rodrigo or something like that.